to get the software from the Arduino help homepage, click on the software tab. and select the version that you want. In our case, in my case, I'm going for the Windows installer. If you want to donate towards the project, you can do, or you can just click on just download and then save the file. Open up the folder you downloaded the file into, double click, to start the install. If you had a previous version of uh, um, the Arduino software installed, it will delete the contents of the folder. We'll just take the default settings and let it go. And when everything's completed, you'll get this screen. Click close and then we can start the Arduino application. The desktop shortcut would be put there, so double click and away we go. And you'll get the default screen. Now just a bit of it, we've downloaded the latest version which is 1.8.3 and what we're going to do is open up the examples Go to the basics and we'll go to the blink. Close the other window and this now gives us the, the default application that's always loaded onto a new Arduino. Now we'll plug in the USB cable into the Uno. The device has come up as COM port 3. So bring it up software. We're now going to look tools, port and select COM port 3. And now go to board and make sure that you select the Arduino Uno. configured the, Uno, the Arduino software for our device. So we're using an Uno and port 3. Press and hold the button
changes to green, after 5 seconds it goes back to red. Press the button.